Hello everyone, welcome to this channel once again, this is Architect Jonas here. And in this episode, I'll teach you all how to create a threshold in Revit. If you are not a member of this family, please subscribe and like. It's how to support. Now let's get into it. First of all, you have to get your 3D as we have always here. And then uh, to do that, we have to um, hover around it and see where we will put our threshold, of course. Let's wait for it for a sec to so it's open by itself. Okay. So let's um, hover around it. As you all could see, we have um, a threshold here. So I want us to create a new one. Um, okay, let's see. Um, somewhere here. Let's um, start. Okay. Okay, so. Okay, so to do that, we have to move straight into our component and let's choose mode in place and let's choose caseway. Okay, so after we're done with that, what we will do again is we have to choose sweep as you open up and then pick a path. That is where we'll be drawing everything. Pick this line here. And then escape two times. Let's move it around the side. Good. So this will be the lens from this side to this side of our wall. Now let's click on finish. Edit profile and let's go. So as you can see. Let's go straight into wireframe to see very well. Let's move straight to the side 900 mm. And let's move here to the top 150 mm. And let's come here 300 mm. Let's repeat the same thing. And that is that. So this is our little threshold. Now let's move into um, realistic and see what we have done. So this is what we just did. Okay, so this is our final work. We have right here. So this is our threshold, and this is how to do the threshold in Revit. So please like and subscribe to this channel once again. It's how to select. Thank you for watching and adios.